I'm meteorologist Peter Hall. Here's the CNY Central first alert weather forecast. Silvery skies through midday. The good news is there's a bunch of clearing over Lake Ontario that's trying to shove its way east and southeast. Now, here's the thing. There's still a west northwest wind coming off the lake and that's an upslope flow and it's not very cold, but it's still chilly enough that I wouldn't be surprised if the clouds still overcome some of that clearing. But the, what I'm trying to the point I'm trying to make is there's at least a chance for some breaks of sunshine. Temperatures hanging around 40 and then by later this afternoon and evening go into the 30s. So there you go. It's a steely Dan gray overcast. Not as mild Wednesday now. We're not expecting temperatures to near 50 anymore. We had mentioned that this morning. Now, this is because we have more of an east to southeast wind Wednesday. A mixed mess Wednesday night, Thursday morning? Well, I believe so. Especially more concerned the further east you are in our viewing area. So, Route 12 corridor, Route 28 corridor. That's a good line to show you. That's Green, Norwich, Sherburn, Utica, Boonville, Alder Creek. Old Forge, that area, is most susceptible in our viewing area and points east of seeing prolonged periods of freezing rain and sleet and maybe some snow mixed in, which could make it icy late Wednesday night and Thursday morning. And we are going to trend colder for Friday and next weekend. So let's just take you through the rest of the day today. And as of noon, like I mentioned, quite a bit of cloud covered locally. Right about in there, I've noticed that some rather clear conditions, at least a little hole in the overcast right there is trying to move its way towards us. Now, like I just mentioned, a west-northwest wind flow is a bad wind flow for central New York because it comes off the lake, it goes up the hills, and then it makes more clouds. But at least there's an opportunity for some peaks of sunshine. Then we look ahead of this evening and a chance for some localized lake effect clouds for a while in a flurry, and then that's it. And then tomorrow morning, it should be partly cloudy. On tap during the day Wednesday, we're okay. Filtered sun through clouds, upper 30s to lower 40s with no weather problems. Winds will be east-southeasterly at about 10 to 15 miles an hour. Problem comes Wednesday night. The winds will bank more easterly, which remember it is January and there's not there's not been a lot of Arctic air, but there's a little bit of chilly air our way. So it'll be cold enough for at least some wintry mix. Now, here's the thing, though. There a, is no Arctic air no, anywhere near us. Number two, we're going to make upper 30s to lower 40s during the day Wednesday. That combination does not bode well to get an extended period of freezing rain and which would be ice, like in other words, rain falls, hits the ground, and then freezes. Might get sleet, which is little ice pellets that bounce. Might get some snowflakes. Problem is, it's not, it's, it's not exactly been below freezing very often. So, unless you're in one of the really cold spots, I would say, yeah, we might get some snowflakes and sleet for Syracuse and central New York, but probably a mainly wet condi condition and scenario. Now, like I mentioned, the further east you go, especially that line. That's roughly the Route 12 and 28 corridor line. Now that line and points east will have colder temperatures. So you guys have the best chance of getting more of a icing scenario, but even there, it's borderline. Otherwise, some leftover rain, and that'll mix with some flurries on Thursday. Temperatures in the upper 30s. Total sun today, between zero and 10%. Tomorrow, 66% sun, and then we're back at this zero to 10% thing on Thursday, depending on where you live. The probability of precipitation is high Wednesday night and Thursday morning. We just mentioned the fact that there's some mix in there. A little window of a wave of snow, a general kind of synoptic, if you want to use the word snow, may occur right around daybreak Friday, one to three inches then. Flurries, squalls and flurries Saturday. Here's your seven-day forecast. More on CNYCentral.com.